Hey guys, this is SpiritMong187 and welcome back for another match of Shadow Era where we are playing Dark Law again and we are playing against a Zana of the Myth deck and well that will not work out pretty nice for this Dark Law deck and you know why, because he's going to heal each return for 3 damage and he has a lot of destructions Right, so um, yeah, this will not be a good match for my dark law, and that will suck because it is the second match that I have uploaded. We are still on 280 uh, rating points. Well, this is fun. I have problem with dark law decks, he says. So let's hope that it's not sarcasm, and let's hope we will win against him because I do think I have a problem against uh, Zan of the Myth decks. Let's see how it, this will work out. We have a pretty nice start here. We have all the cards that we need in our hand. Uh, especially Blood Moon is pretty nice because you draw a card with it. And it's the only card draw that we have. Here comes a Larian Seductress. And we are going to get rid of a. Now you're mine, I think. Yeah, why not? So we're going to play a Capture Prey or what big deal, sorry, Capture Prey. And let's just hit her in the face. Or her. Mm. Let's hit these on the mess. Let's see what he will do. I have problems. So, Amber Rain deck is not much of a problem. I faced some of the Amber Rain decks and it worked out pretty well for me in the end. So, next turn we are going to kill this Lyarian Seductress and give one damage to Zana Mist. Because he used his ability to draw a card, so he cannot heal his Seductress. This will be interesting. Yes, it will. And I fought against one of his clan members. Um, it was in the top 12. He was at spot 12 of the ranking list. And he played a Gravebone deck. And I've won pretty easily from that deck. But you do not see Gravebone decks a lot. At least not serious Gravebone deck, I think. Let's see what he's going to do. Here we have a full moon, we can get rid of that easily. And play the speed strike. Hit the Seductress. And hit the Zana. Missed face for one damage. And remove one durability from his weapon, of course. Which is also pretty important. There comes a focus prayer. Play against this uh, grave. Let's run the guy from his clan, right? Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's focus on the match. Um, normally I wouldn't sacrifice this card, this Eagle Ascendance, and now I will, I think. Okay, let's get rid of it. Play a new one big T. Hit him in the face. And for one more. How was it? Uh, he's a good player. Top 15, I think. Uh, yeah, top. He's at spot 12 of 
the world, but I won. Uh, let's see, what did he play? Uh, let's fuck a little match. Uh, Elizabeth Winterborn, so he's drawing some more cards. And uh, that's not nice. And uh, what if I play target opponent, can't attack, defend, or use abilities? But I do think this ability will still be activated, so. And we have to remove this weapon. Mm -hmm. Okay. I know what we're going to do. Mm, I think I'm going to attack him, move his durability from his weapon. Um, and then use my ability to pump up my weapon, attack his Winterborn. Yeah. So he will receive a bit less damage. But if I use my ability first, he would not lose durability from his... If I use my ability first, his weapon would not be destroyed, so... And I don't want him to draw more cards. I'll tell him that I'm recording this match. This match for... YouTube, by the way. So there comes a Aeon. Um, can we get rid of her speed strike? Oh, let's change the camera. <laughs> um, let's see, what do we want to play here? Oh, we do want this one uh, to get out. And we have two resources left. To play what? To play nothing. If we have three resources left, we still would we'll play nothing. So let's just capture spray this guy. Hit him in the face. And yeah for two more. Because we do want to get rid of a storm call because I cannot target any other allies so I have to get rid of it ASAP. And maybe he's going to play a tidal wave soon but maybe he sacrificed all of them because he was not thinking of. Wow. That was a game changer. All attachments were removed. Well luckily I've kept the speed strike. Um, let's see, let's just skip this. Play this. Done. But we are not going to move any attachment here. And hit the A on the face, destroy it. And just enter him. So there you move my captured prey and my speed strike. That's a pretty nice card for a priest deck. Here comes the Elizabeth Winterborn. So we do want to give her some damage. Mm. Well, we are just going to skip this, I think. And play. play one. Let's get rid of this one. Play this one. We just hit on the face for two. Well, why not? Let's give her two damage. And he can heal at the end of the turn. Well, maybe it was a bit stupid. Because he can attack me and now heal at the end of the turn to draw another card. Next turn, we are going to retrieve my weapon. comes another big ally and he's going to draw another card. Uh, it's getting out of hand. Let's get rid of the now your mine. Um, I guess I'm going to destroy him. I will just have to face the Winterborn. We cannot do anything about it at this point in the game. Let's play the one big teeth. And hit him in the face with ambush. Oh my god, I didn't have a speed strike. Oh my god, what am I doing? Ah, I forgot about speed strike. There comes a wizard step. Okay, he's drawing cards. We have to just let that be. 
there comes the destruction from one of my weapons, that sucks. 4 damage in the face. And he's going to end turn, I think. Now he's going to hit me as well. For one more damage. Take me down to 15. Okay. Well, we are going to play the Evil Send. And destroy the weapon, I guess. Skip this one here. Mm. Wow, we're going to you know, we're going for speed strike and destroy his weapon. So we will take some damage this turn, but next turn we got a full moon, so we can prevent some damage. There comes a captured prey, which is also nice. Seductress for him. More damage in the face, take it down to 13. And okay. We're going to play a capture prey on him. Play this one on her. And we're just going to set this one out. And receive some damage from the winter point. We have three cards in hand, the lone wolf I cannot play and the evil ascendants I cannot play as well because we already have one in play. And this sucks, another knife. Wow, that's a lot of damage. And that's what I hate about playing against Sana. He got his healing options and he can destroy lots of my items and artifacts. Um, let's get rid of this one and well, we could retrieve my weapon and destroy this knight or now we're going to take down both of these elements I guess or not first thing first let's retrieve our because we know he has a knight of golden dawn in his hand play this, use this ability, and we can attack and destroy both of these, which will save us 5 damage. And next turn he will attack me maybe, yeah, he will attack, so let's just kill off these two guys, and Let's get rid of Let's see what he's going to do now. If he's going to attack me, let's hope he doesn't draw anything good. Let's hope he's just something small or stupid, small ally or something. I'm just going to heal him and herself. There comes the second knight. And the Aeon Stormcrawler. Well, that's pretty much my death wish. Um. To start your next turn from the island, go it back and your hero take no damage. That's nice. So we could do that some damage to this Aeon. Let's attack him for two, for one, sorry. Take no zero damage for ourselves. Take him down one more. And he has eight, nine, ten, eleven damage next turn. Ah, good Jasmine. We can only take down the AL next turn. Here comes another Eva Ascendance. Well, we have that scrap. We cannot use that card. Up three. Three more. And end turn. And he already got his ability charged up. So these first two matches of 2014 are not doing well. And believe me, I've won some matches with this Dark Cloud deck, but this is just a bummer. And three more damage for me, taking me down to three health. I just want to heal up this knight, it sucks. And bouncing back and put it into play again. Mmm, well. Another lone wolf, that won't help me. Hmm. 
that's it. GG. Let's attack this one so we will die. Well, that's it. Uh, do not forget to like, subscribe, comment. I'll put in a uh, decklist again below. And yeah, we're still going down in rating and we will not rise in score points, but next match will be better, I promise you. Cheers!